Hey guys, Dr. G here. I'm going to take just a couple minutes and tell you about why I became a coach educator or a professor uh, and hopefully a scholar. So number one is I coached for years, coached for a long time at every level, youth, high school, uh, college, professionally. And when I was in grad school, I started coming into really more research, psychology of coaching, sociology of coaching, philosophy of science. Okay, I really actually love that stuff. Uh, I teach that stuff. And so I love writing 25 page papers, book chapters, you know, special issue journals. So being a scholar, and I use the word scholar coach at times in our program very purposefully uh, uh, to denote that we really wanna prepare uh, uh, well-rounded, uh, thoughtful, caring, ethical coaches. And so uh, I love being a scholar, okay? I love being a teacher at the higher education, in higher education, and working with college students. Teaching is similar to coaching. So the feedback, the instruction, the growth, uh, the positive impact and what they do to you and how students transform you. Uh, I love all that part. My family uh, had taught, my mom and dad at times were teachers uh, and administrators as well and, and business people. And so I've kind of carried that on to my own life uh, and it's a great way for me to combine sport and teaching. Uh, and then the last one is working with students on a daily basis, helping students live uh, meaningful lives, grow, develop resiliency, enhance uh, and reach their own personal and professional goals. Uh, in turn, then they in, uh, affect the communities and the athletes and their families that are around them uh, and the other uh, athletes, families and, and et cetera. So it exponentially increases. So again, why do I do what I do? Why did I become a coach educator? Uh, and, a, and a coach educator too is a special thing um, because it's, it's not saying I'm, I am just a scientist or I'm just a researcher. A coach educator really is somebody in the field too that is invested in the teaching and learning and development and lifelong learning of coaches. And that's really what we specialize here too. Uh, and that's what my own research does as well. So being a scholar, uh, teaching is similar to coaching and watching people grow and then working with our students and educating coaches, which I believe is one of the most pressing social concerns of our time and that we need to provide coaches with high quality education, lifelong learning, and they're in turn, and when we do that right, they're in turn gonna take that to the communities and truly the world will be a better place. So that's where I get my passion for uh, be being a scholar, coach educator.